Race is ready. Set. Go. I decided I needed to kind of focus on myself on, go, because go, I was just go, getting go. worse. I wasn't getting any better. And I was continuing to put everything and everyone else in front of, of my care. In 2008, I was um, sexually assaulted by my fiance. As my career progressed, my injuries got significantly worse. And then um, in 2013 is when um, I needed my first hip surgery from that. Since then, I've had three hip surgeries just to kind of to repair all of the damage from the assault. And go to the turf. Move, leg. <laughs> All right, just fall sideways. Oh, God. Parachute landing, fall. I got enrolled in Air Force Wounded Warrior in May of 2016, specifically for adaptive sports because I was recovering from my first hip surgery. Yeah. For me, initially, um, it, it was more about the adaptive sports, learning how to heal from my from my injury and from my surgeries. There was something that I could do for, for exercise and to stay fit, and I didn't have to just, you know, be a couch potato for the rest of my life. The more that I exercised, the better that my body felt, and then, of course, then the better that my injuries felt, and I was able to just keep doing more and more with my, with my life. But yeah, so they talked about that. After I started attending the camps is when I realized that I had PTSD. I started listening to other people's stories and realized, oh, well, I do that, or I, that happens to me, or that's the way that I feel. I don't think I probably ever would have been diagnosed and treated if I hadn't been introduced to Air Force Wounded Warrior. So I'm incredibly thankful for, for that as well. So my family has been incredibly supportive through everything. There's no way I would be able to have this much training without, without them by my side. And so my husband works night shift, and so he has pretty much just given up his sleep since trials in order for me to train for Warrior Games. Lately he's done all the housework and all the laundry and helps prepare meals, helps do grocery shopping. He has just completely taken the entire load off of me. And then my daughter is six years old. So excited and just wants to like just cheer for her mommy. She comes to training with me, she comes to the gym with me. She'll work out side by side with me as best as she can, or she's cheering me on. So she's just been not only supportive, but just such a good behaved child to get me through this. I wanna be like you. You wanna be like me? I am feeling uh, half exhausted and tired, and then half just really, really excited. <laughs> um, I that my adrenaline is kind of just going crazy right now. You know, we're getting flooded with all of this information about what is going on and what to prepare for and what's happening next. And so I have good anxiety. It's something I've never been to before. And so uh, right now, the excitement of the unknown is kind of over the fear of the unknown. And so I'm just trying to use that fuel in my training and just kind of keep pushing forward until the very last day.